This is room 612 at the Sheraton Universal Hollywood. This is just your standard two queen room. When you come in, there's not any overhead lighting, so you have to come in and hope that your windows are open or turn on the lights over here. But as we walk in, you can see a nice little sitting area. much of a view, but if I move this out, if you look past it, look past the building that we're over, and as I come around, you'll see, just ignore our bags, two queen bed, basic, lots of pillows, we do have two regular outlets side drawers. Again, nightstand with side drawers. This one's a little deeper. iHome clock, which means you're going to have the two USBs on top. Remote for the television, which is here. And then we have our reading lights. You can just flip the light. It takes a second to come on. And then over here, you'll see a beverage station. The water was here. More drawers. Just more storage. This is a small bevy cooler. It's not very cold. So definitely just for beverages. Don't put anything like milk or something that will spoil. Coffee maker, not a Keurig. So you will need to use these, which is decaf only, oh my, to get that fixed. It is Starbucks though. And then closet. See the safe down on the bottom, just your typical Digi Hotel safe. And a quick look at the bathroom. It's not very big. Do you have a pretty big shower head? Your shampoo and conditioner and body wash is on the wall. Most places are doing that now. But it does have a handheld as well as an overhead non slip mat. toilet, sink, and reusables. The Hollywood side, and we have a pocket door with a full length mirror. One other thing to show you, I noticed when I was pulling out our cords, there are some lights this way. I mean, I'm sorry, some outlets this way. So USB outlets and then regular outlet as well as here. So there's plenty of places to charge. Tell you all about the VIP, which we are actually doing tomorrow. I booked it before I got here though, because they are selling out like hotcakes. It is the only way as of right now, uh, July 6th of 2023 to get into Nin Super Nintendo World for sure, and even more so with an Unlimited Express Pass for Bowser's Challenge. So you can see this is the hotel paper that they gave me, food and beverage, room tips about Wi-Fi, all the things. So we can walk over from here to City Walk that will get us into the parks. It sits right next door to the Hilton, which is right here. We're actually moving over to the Hilton tomorrow. He advised that we move our vehicle with us since we have VIP. 
because we won't have to pay to park at City Walk. And the parking charge for us here will just be added to our room. So again, just a basic two queen room, Sheraton Universal. Oh, so but it is a bit of a shadow. Yeah. And okay. in this case, I would. Okay. I've done it always, and that's the hardest way. Okay, <laughs> we'll just take the shadow. Thank you. And how late does it run as far as? Um, about 11 tonight. About 12 tomorrow. Okay, perfect. Thank you. The shadow for the Hilton and the Sheraton is going to be right here in between Bubba Gump and Johnny Rocket. So you just walk right here, right by NBC Grill. And right here, and you can see and it will tell you when the next one is. It is currently 9.58. 